Meng Xiaodong, Queen of Laosheng. Meng Xiaodong was a famous Peking opera performer. She was the Queen of Laosheng because she embodied the role of the strong or dominant male character called Laosheng in Peking opera performances. She was born on December 9, 1908 in Shanghai County, China, during the rule of the Qing Dynasty. Ironically, it's the very same era to which the art form Peking opera was born. She was born in a time when China was thriving under the Qing Dynasty. It became a popular form of entertainment. Peking opera was developed as a result of fusion, at, as a result of the fusion and evolution of local and regional opera styles from northern and southern China. Meng became the only female disciple to study at the Yu School of Vocal and Performing Style founded by Master Yu Shuyang. She and perfected her craft and became the leading female performer of the role of Lao Shang. Shang in Peking Opera is the male role or character. The Lao Shang is the dignified senior male role. Lao Shang characters in Peking Opera are distinguished by having a beard, black or white, and are characterized as having dignity and polished manners, and are usually middle-aged scholars or mandarin. Meng became famous for her performances as Lao Shang due to her charisma and expressive body language on stage. In August of 1925, she was introduced to Mei Lan Feng, and a love affair ensued. Mei Lan Feng was at the time the leading performer of King Gu Yi roles, the virtuous and elite female character. The two met while co-starring in the Phoenix. In an effort to manipulate the public image of Lan Feng, a marriage between the two was arranged. The couple collaborated on a film and in 1927 were married. Their relationship was filled with conflict, including the many wives of Mei, two others, and the college student, a fan that secretly harbored romantic feelings for Meng. After learning of the marriage between Mei and Meng, the student Li Xingang attempted to rob Mei, in which Mei was shot and Li was shot and killed. The marriage between Mei and Meng has been said to have been one of the strangest blends of art and life. As a result of mounting issues and conflict, Meng and Meng's relationship was short-lived and the two divorced in 1933. In 1949, Meng found her way to British Hong Kong. There, she met famous Shanghai gangster Du Yusheng, to which she married. In 1951, the couple divorced and Meng ended her career. Meng moved to Taiwan in 1967, where she remained until her death in 1977 at age 69. Life is a dramatic format. The very same format to which Peking Opera draws some of its storylines. Actress and Peking Opera diva Wei Hamin, in fact, delivered an exquisite performance portraying Mei Meng in the 2010 Peking Operatic musical Meng Xiaodong. Wei Hamin is now Peking Opera diva of Taiwan. In her portrayal of Meng, she sang in three completely different voices, a challenge that had never been attempted before in Peking Opera. The life of Peking Opera legend has been recreated and her likeness has been portrayed by other celebrated performers. Celia Yip performed her likeness in the films Lord of the East China Sea and China Sea 2. Yan Lei Li Yi both played the role of Meng in the film Forever Enthralled. A biographer titled Meng Xiaodong, a dream catcher in the woolen blanket, has an immense amount of historical information detailing Meng's life and career.